Hello, I am Professor Zahoor, ex-dean faculty of fine arts, Jamia Millia Islamia University, New Delhi. Today's module is how to look at the thing, how to perceive things and how to keep things intact. We have chosen the subject of moonlight. We will make two paintings here. It is difficult to make in so dark. One needs to manage to hold the colors and catch the essence of the scene. Where the details vanish, you paint whatever you feel. I will take the canvas to the studio and rest of the work will be done there for finishing the Main motive was to catch the essence and after that done, one can finish it in the food. Moonlight painting is an exercise to search for the object lost in the darkness of the night. Even if one cannot see much of the details, one just needs to start by applying a dark shade. Here, I am going to fill the canvas with strokes of burnt sign. At the initial stage, one can't make out what is going to be out through the dark colors. But to bring out the essence of the scene, it is just important to work on. Burnt Sina will act as a base tone to the burn on by even more darker tone. Working on the concept of Don R.C. Part, where he says, My paintings evolve originally from life's everyday glance rather than trying to force my will on them. I give them total control. Each layer determines and guides the next. Here too, application of another dark color, Van Dyke Brown over the horizon will lead one to another level of understanding the dark colors, values and textures of brush strokes will form their own shapes by interlocking light and shadow. Another layer of Persian blue over the burnt sign of one will create interplay of tones. In the sky area, the strokes are oblique. While in lower part, my brush is moving vertical. Which will create various effects of same color at different places. A wet and wild environment is already being reflected on the canvas. The more we work on it, the more essence of the scene being painted will come out. All the colors will appear dusky in the dark. 
as one side cannot catch the tone being created but an artist is manifest in the nature exposed by his spirit the tone of green over the lower layers is just a lighter tone but without much of its sparkle and freshness lemon yellow white and blue are forming a murky look at the lower base of the painting Senino Senini said this is an occupation known as painting which calls for imagination and skill of the hand in order to discover things not seen hiding themselves under the shadow of natural object and to fix them with the hand presenting to plain sight what does not actually exist A single stroke of the brush acts as an element in itself. Application of light tone close to horizon and the skyline will form a dark patch of a shape dividing the sky from the background. it will help in guessing the source of light peep into inner vision and looking for virtuosity and mystery It is a doorway into a spiritual space. It is an expression of transcendent form that opens out into the infinite. William De Raymond One cannot even imagine how many times one might need to apply light over dark and again dark over light. As per the vibes coming from the painting and beat of the moment. Again a few strokes of blue and crimson on the right side of foreground to act as another dark layer. Which is again being coated by white. To a spectator, it might look like a rough ground. 
where the light is falling for the rumbling river with the flow of the fresh strokes the essence of wildness can come out beautifully there is no clear light of the object as they have been completely absorbed by the darkness of the night there is a freedom of the one layer of color being placed over the other and this insistent reworking will only bring out the beauty Now is the time to create a source of light. That is the moon, which will throw its sharp light over the whole scene and add another mood to the scene. Too. A light will play its music over the ripples of water and add the flavor of playfulness in the rise and fall of the flow of water. The pure white of the moon has become the pivot around which the moon will develop. The areas close to the moon will get lighter in tone and get diffused close to the edges of the canvas. Claude Monet, the great impressionist artist, very aptly said, "When you go out to paint, try to forget what object you have before—a tree, a house, a field, or whatever. Merely think, there is a little square of wood here, an oblong of pink. Here is a streak of yellow. A paint is just as it looks to you, the exact color." until it emerges as your own deep impression of the scene to come The painting being made here is exactly the nail impression of the tune being played on the chord of mind by the darkness and light. The conscious and subconscious minds are just moving with the sensual and addictive rhythm of the white in the dark. The rough patches in the sky will peacefully give an impression of clouds with silver light. One can't even imagine from which color the painting started and now where it has been.
This is what is known as a creative process that takes place in front of us. By us and yet it's difficult to analyze the play of over one work with passionate indifference and yet enjoy at the deep level of blend of application of colors when the mind is transported to another world another reality yet away from worldly reality placing the strokes too much particular and the intricate representation sometimes hinder the visual form and destroy the aesthetic beauty. The whole scene is mysteriously enclosed and full of excitement, inspiration and wonder. One is painting the scene which one has seen thousand times but through the vision of the spirit. The known scene becomes totally unknown and an area to be explored. to my perspective and perception the colors and textures will trip the essence of the scene Dan Tom Porter a painting has the power to condense 15 impressions to one Here too again dark and the patch dividing the sky and the ground without being too much conscious with the strokes and avoid stifling the image development concentrate and yet be open to the experiment and to the idea of bringing out something new which once owns it and creating a unique individual a few patches here and there will add new dimensions in the construction of the reality in another light it will fertilize the imagination also the depicted scene will become the baby of artist imagination and the essence he has fed his mind
just like the US flying set for the painting blue i had left the visible physical proof at the door outside in the street the real blue was inside the blue of the proof funded in space the blue of my kingdom of our kingdom the immaterialization of blue the colored space that cannot be seen but this we fact our self Now the time for giving birth to another scene is in life, where one can clearly see the contrast of the source of life against the prevailing dark. Fill the canvas with the shades of dark brown and Persian blue. touches of burnt sand to bring out the darkness for adding a gradation to the tones mix yellow of the for the light of the After the oblique stroke, fill in the sky. Add vertical patches of darker tone close to horizon and spread it across the whole surface. Then apply white. keeping it sharp at the horizon and diffusing it further up in the sky every stroke will tell its own story and form its importance Kendall Sky once said there is no form there is nothing in the world which is not of us it is true the message does not reach our soul either because it has no meaning and for it seems or as it is more like because it has not been conveyed to the right way every serious work rings in part like the calm and dignified world here i am the painting might seem so distant from the reality yet over the time of being worked upon in multiple layers of light and shade will find 
its way back to reality somehow the imagination along with vision skill colors and texture will form their own meaningful pictorial language it will turn out to be a personal vision of an artist of the world by entering fast and very real of the experience and experimentation using stacks will help contrast with enigmatic brush strokes in parts a dramatic look to a simple scene The outline has been mapped out. Shadowed area noted keeping in mind the highlighted spots where light will reflect from various angled structures. Reinforcing deeper shadows and overall tone required to suit the mood of the composition. Confirms to the direction and placement of the source of light. The final result will just indicate the way on which the idea has been articulated with a perfect blend of imagination and intellect all these said in final and less a point simply is no longer a point no matter how self sufficient its execution may be and the more profoundly the imaginary lines of projection meet higher dimension the better the world of imagination and observation is boundless one can trigger it as much as possible and form unique visual statements ideas stories and concepts and give vent to the feeling of creation in unlimited way one needs to put the contrast of the sharp light falling on the bottom surface now the light patch will stand out in the darkness and speak for you the source of light governs everything whether it is a daisy or one in moonlight one's day to day observations of the nature help in creating a work of art with a totally different perception where there can be just suggestions to represent an object or there can be an intricate depiction the representation may not all be close to the reality but can pull one in the world of abstraction
what matters finally is the correct thing. by cutting out most of the breach band an artist's soul is never tired of putting layers and layers of his clothes to bring out the exact impression so that the painting ultimately turns out to be a work of his mind. To conclude the module, I would, while giving the final touches, Ernest Krishner who said, It seems as though the goal of my work has always been to dissolve my, myself completely into the sensation of the surrounding in order to then integrate this into a coherent painterly form.